Welcome back guys, appreciate you tuning in. Today we're going to discuss my Seaway Welcome back guys, appreciate you tuning in. So today we're going to discuss my CYA Supply Company holster uh, that I recently bought for a new carry pistol that I got in. So I wanted to upgrade my carry pistol. I'd, uh, I've got quite a few Canics and uh, like those. Uh, they're more full size. I had the SC, which I found to be a little bit too big for concealed carry just for comfort level uh, it's doable but uh, I wanted uh, the MC9 the new uh, it's not new new but it's been out for a little while the uh, Mete MC9 which is their micro compact uh, gets good reviews and I wanted to try it with that I needed another holster and in the past I had gotten holsters typically Kydex holsters from different manufacturers and I found this company on uh, Amazon again link in the description below uh, you'll find my um, uh, landing page or my campsite page which will take you to my Amazon store go over there this holster along with plenty of other things um, that we review are in that store so with that said, um, I found this company, they're veteran owned, and uh, they do things a little different when it comes to holsters because most people think Kydex. Well, this is not Kydex. Uh, this is called Bolteron, B-O-L-T-A-R-O-N, which is the material used. Now, with that said, they say that there is some like pros and cons to each against Kydex to the Bolteron stuff. Um, I found that um, I kind of like this. Uh, not that I dislike Kydex, um, but I uh, wanted to again give this uh, guy a try and his holsters. So the good thing about these holsters, they're really reasonable and they're one day shipping a lot of times. A lot of these Kydex manufacturers, you got to wait you know, a week or two before you get them things like that and they're quite a bit more expensive price point on this one uh, currently right now is 3377 uh, on Amazon so it's a basic holster there's nothing fancy about it there's not a lot of um, doodads and you know whatever on here um, it is a very thin material which I like um, the purpose of a concealed carry holster is to protect your trigger guard have a secure way to keep your firearm on you uh, carrying concealed and this one uh, does that very well it's very lightweight material and it is um, uh, very thin kind of show you the profile um, it doesn't feel fragile to me it's just thin and uh, which I think actually makes it more con not concealable but more comfortable it's not as thick so again, we'll check the firearm for safety, no magazine, uh, nothing in the firearm itself. Um, locks up like this. It does have a retention screw here um, that if you want to tighten it up. Uh, this is about where I want it. Uh, personally, it's easier to do it when it's in, the, in your belt, but um, you can hear it snap in like that. Um, they do have Mete M9 right here, or MC. Uh, nine written right here kind of hard to pick up in camera the angle is a somewhat adjustable I'm fine with it the way it is CYA supply company is I guess that's laser engraved or whatever right there um, on the belt clip itself comes in a basic bag nothing too fancy with that um, and it gives you some options as far as the way to carry this one obviously is designed for the Mete uh, with the uh, RMR cut. This is what this one is. Uh, this is a Sig Romeo Zero is the site I have on here, which was actually on my SC9 and I just moved it over. But if you're looking for a reasonably priced holster, I've been carrying this for probably close to a month now. Um, very comfortable and uh, feels secure as any holster I've ever carried. Uh, it does have a sweat guard on this one that comes all the way up to protect your firearm. Um, but yeah, overall, just a basic holster at a reasonable price point at $33.77 currently on Amazon, and I like it. But uh, CYA Supply Company, check them out. 
lifetime warranty, veteran owned, uh, made in the USA. But anyway, guys, if you've got any questions, post those below. If you've got any experience with the CYA Supply Company, uh, be sure to chime in on that and let us know your thoughts. Uh, but so far, this will probably be my go-to holster company um, going forward, just because I like simplicity. I don't have to have the claw and things like that. The claw is fine. If I had a negative to say about this, because it is a single screw retention instead of a two screw retention, uh, right here, a lot of the claws that you could add is for two screws with that said i did find one that had one screw but i've been carrying it without the claw i'm perfectly fine without it and just as is but anyway guys appreciate you tuning in if you got any questions post those below and as always like share and subscribe bring another video shortly have a great day